All right, so I'm on my way back. Here's the Continental Tire support. And that's the hill. The back side of that is where the corkscrew is. And when you visit here, you either get to see the corkscrew or you get to see the rest of the track. And I'll, uh, we'll get up there. I'll explain it, but it is a hike. Um, I'm holding the camera at a pretty good up angle. Hang on, once I get clear of these buildings, you'll see <laughs> just how tall that hill is. BB racing for fuel. Should be a landmark you all can see the scoring tower. Eatery. Level five motorsports. here for a sec. This is the Cooper Tire Bridge. It used to be Yokohama Tire Bridge. In fact, I think we could cross it. The footbridge will put us on the infield. Not as if we're already on the infield. This will go even more infield. I do not believe I have seen this before. It really looks like a go-kart track slash autocross light layout. In the infield of Laguna Seca. Alright, anyway. Let's continue. Oh, you can't smell anything, but I'm smelling barbecued chicken, barbecued there, teriyaki, pork sandwiches. Oh, that smells so good. Yeah, I'm walking around talking to the camera. Everybody else looks like I'm talking to myself. That's cool. You just don't give a crap, you know. All right, so now we're crossing over. This way.
and there's a lake. Uh, some of the teams put up, or vendors, you know, put up little huts around here. There's a good spot to look at the exit of turn two down there. We'll wrap our way around there too. And again, the hill. Cut this off here.